We're in the North Cascades National Park Service Complex. And for this video, we're gonna show you around Ross Lake National Recreation Area. I'm Randy with my daughter, Natalie. Thanks for traveling with us. Hope you enjoyed the video. This is interesting. We are gonna drive across the Diablo Dam straight to our trailhead. This is a pretty cool sight. Ross Lake, National Recreation Area, Diablo Lake Trail, 1,300 feet, elevation change, 7.6 miles long. Ross Lake is the most accessible part of the North Cascades National Park Complex. It follows the Skagit River and Route 20 runs through the park. There are three reservoirs in the complex, Ross Lake itself, Diablo Lake, and Gorge Lake. The dams, also with the same names, were built in the 20s and 30s, and they provide power to the residents in Seattle. Unfortunately, if you visit, you'll notice they also scar the landscape with very visible and unattractive power line. The area was later established as a national park unit in 1968. Thankfully, a study is currently underway to remove one or possibly more of the dams. What are you doing back there, Natalie? Good. It's pretty steep though. It is. I wonder if I can be able to finish this. Uh, you got it. Remember, the mind gives in before the what? Before the body gives out. Oh, you've been trained well. Sometimes you just need motivational goals to help you get to the end. And what I want you to think about are those ramen noodles. Ramen noodles tonight for dinner on the new, listen, whoa, 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 on the new jet boil stove that we just bought, huh? That is very tempting. <laughs> oh, just keep pressing on. Yeah, this one is uh, pretty sharp on the elevation. I'm, I'm hoping that there's some nice views on the end of this trail for us. They're so unique. Yeah. I think they're so pretty, especially when they're planted or they grow naturally by a stream mm -hmm. of water. Yeah. Maybe a little Japanese rock garden. Gorgeous plants, huge out here.
made it. All right, nice job. Good job on this hike, Natalie. Ah, uh, you too. Thank you very much. We accomplished our goal. We made it all the way up to the overlook. Yep. That was beautiful. Yeah, very nice. Good hike. Pretty strenuous, but um, it's getting dark and we need to get back and get some dinner. Speaking of dinner, <laughs> the ramen noodles. Are you ready on the new Jet Boil stove? What do you think? Uh, you can have you can have my portion, Dad. <laughs> <laughs> You want another steak, don't you? Oh, that, I would go for a steak from Sahican. <laughs> All right, way to go, Natalie. We'll get you some good dinner tonight. All right. Let's hit the road. Well, so much for Washington Pass, Natalie. A big gate with a massive snow machine right behind it. Oh, man. So as you can see, the road to Washington Pass was closed, but uh, we're gonna hike in, try to get up to the top by ourselves. And I uh, wasn't expecting this, Natalie, but we're middle June and the snow flurries are coming down. So we'll put on some, some snow gear and uh, we're gonna make our way up to the top of Washington Pass. Let's go. Look at the size of the chains on those tires. Wow. That's what you need up here. They get so much snow. I mean, look at this, mid-June. And it's still on the still on the streets in some places. I believe it's basically summer. You can see why this road is still closed. I mean, it just takes a beating in the winter time. Down trees all over the place, snow still on the street, potholes along the road. But uh, I'm sure they'll clean it all up and uh, have this place ready for the summer season. overview of Diablo Lake at Ross Lake National Recreation Area. We want to close out the video at this time. If you haven't done so yet, please subscribe to our channel and remember there's always room for you on every National Park adventure. There sure is. Thanks for watching.